Hi, hello, welcome to Bell English. This is a great opportunity provided by a Canadian company in specific to the industry of farming. It's a farming field job opening provided by PNH Farming Limited. That's a permanent job and a full-time job with LMIA. Farming, as you people know, what a farmer does and how the farming functions. And most of them would be aware of the day-to-day -day routines of a farming job. So before we get into the details of this particular job posting, if you are new to the channel or new viewer to the video, please do subscribe to the channel and click the bell button next to it so that you'll receive regular video updates on daily job postings. Do follow us on Instagram and Facebook. I've given the page links on the below description box. Yes, let's see this opening. It's a farm job in Canada and it's open for foreigners. The employer is open for foreigners who are ready to work with him and start the job as soon as possible as a permanent employee in their farming fields. The company name is PNH Farming Limited and they are a family owned company. And this company is looking for someone who can help them on farming as a farmer, farmer helper, farmer and siding installer. Farmer, as you know, what a farmer does it's like planting crops and then maintaining them and then again you have to harvest them farmer helper who assist the farmer in the process of cultivation in the process of harvesting and maintaining the plantation siding installer are someone who creates the sidings or the fences for the farming field to make sure that not any alien or third person or any other disruptions entering into the farming field and causing harm to the crops and this position is actually a permanent job so as soon as you become a permanent employee with a full-time employment in Canada you are entitled to have all the benefits as per the labor market and the labor law you are supposed to have all the benefits given by the employer so you'll have your medical coverage you'll have your retirement benefits you'll have all the other benefits which a permanent canadian employee enjoys with the permanent employment and the language the employer is preferring is english besides if you do have exposure on punjabi he is very well happy to take you up so basically they are a Punjabi family owned company so they are looking for someone who knows Punjabi as well even if you don't know that's not at all a problem they are just giving it as a preference but still if you are fluent enough in English it is fine for the family and make sure you know English you have better standards of English for making communication and understanding the instructions from the farmer from the uh, excuse me from the employer so you should have that skill of understanding and then uh, uh, responding in english to the employer's queries or comments or any other instructions minimum education they are not bothered at all so even if you don't have an education that's completely fine for the employer so before i explain this noz group mentioned here let me explain what NOC is. NOC is an opening or a code which has been given by the Canadian government for employing the foreigners based on their skill sets. The NOC will be categorized for each profession, for each experience and the field of work would have a different NOC. So based on that NOC, the employers can recruit the foreigners and they have to show that NOC to the LMIA, the labor market, for justifying the shortage of the actual resource or the skill in their local labor market. So that's why the NOC is being quoted here. And this job categorized as NOC group carpenter. Please don't mistake it with the designation. The designation is farmer helper farmer and siding installer so they are looking for 
all the three they need a farmer they need a farmer helper and as well as a siding installer but the noc which is being claimed for this position is carpenters which is 7271 that's the noc so and the job title as per the noc is carpenter that doesn't mean you have to be a carpenter with a carpeting experience or you have to have carpenting qualification it is enough if you don't have an education with basic english and for communication purpose and understanding english and you are able to do farming and be as a farming helper and if you know siding installation so it's fine you can apply for this job the just that the noc as per the labor market and as per the canadian immigration so the noc quoted here is carpenter and 7271 is the noc number the job location is surrey british columbia uh, it's, it's a very uh, hugely popular bc is a, a bigger city and it has a huge population and you'll have all the form almost most of the foreign people living in bc and it's a lively place to go with and the job description is being mentioned here as this position is open for one farmer one farmer helper and one siding installer as we were discussing about this the employer is looking for all the three he want one farmer he want one farmer helper and as well as one siding installers siding installers you people might have already done that just that you wouldn't have got exposed to this term siding installer is nothing but the person who actually installs the uh, fences for the farming fields the basic fencing or with uh, uh, iron fencing or sometimes with few uh, blocks wooden blocks or with uh, wooden uh, uh, plantations or few plants so that might differ depending on the field and the region where you are located and it's just that you are creating a fence for the field farm field the experience it's not at all necessary even if you are a fresher or even if you don't have exposure you still can apply for this job it is open for all of them who are willing to work and most specifically the employer is looking for someone who can do hard work and a full-time employee and work as a full-time employee so he is looking for someone who can do a hard work and be as a full-time worker in their form they have a positive lma if required so that's for the foreigners so if they have wanted to recruit you from your country so they can very well sponsor you with this lmia so they do have a positive lmia if at all there is a scenario where they have to recruit a foreigner they can use that lmia so that's that's very important the labor market impact assessment is very important for taking any foreigner as an employee in canada so they have that positive lma so they have claimed that there is shortage of skills in their local labor market and as we were mentioning this about punjabi if you do have exposure or no punjabi it's a plus but not mandatorily required so it's it's just that the employer is specifying it since they are hailing from punjabi background so if you are having that exposure he would just treat it as a plus but still not mandatory so how to apply you can apply through email so i've given this post on the below description box through a website link the job post is available on the description box you can click open it go through this post yourself you can apply to the email address mentioned along with your updated resume so make sure it's an updated resume along with your updated cover letter so cover letter as we've been discussing this in almost all of our job postings it's very important to have a grasping cover letter with attractive an explanation about your background position your experience and your exposures and that is where the employer gets impressed so you are supposed to have a great writing on your cover letter so have a updated cover letter along with your updated resume and if you do have a portfolio or profile or any data which actually can show how much you are efficient enough either might be from your previous employment or through any other work that could actually 
add value for the employer to consider your profile so add that as well along with your email and send it across and you'll hear back from the employer once you get shortlisted so i guess we have covered enough information about this job posting here if you do have any other questions please let me know in the comment section i'll be really pleased to assist you and explain things to you over there so before i sign off do subscribe to the channel and click the bell button next to it follow us on instagram and facebook i've given the pages link on the below description box and most importantly this post is available and given on the below description box through a link so the job post is given there so you can access it and write your application through email to the employer along with your updated resume and cover letter we'll see you soon with another new job posting till then take care guys bye bye